Something tells me that what is about to happen um, isn't the usual. It's not the ambrosia usual. salad. It is not. That is correct. There are no marshmallows being harmed in this viewing. <laughs> None at all. That is so I like canned stuff. That's right. like that's like yeah. spaceship kind of yeah. stuff. Yeah. yeah. Okay. For what sure. are you making it with? Okay. First, I want to talk about pomegranates. Are uh, they in season right now? They're coming back. Okay. Uh, you can find some. There's great ones coming out of Israel for those that want them. That's going to be your traditional pomegranate. Okay. California and such, they'll be knocking some out shortly. So, people want to cut and core and peel. The easiest way to do this is you cut it in half. Mm -hmm. You give it one squeeze with your hand. And back it up. Like so. And then yeah, you take watch. out some of the aggression from your 9 to 5 job. And you can see how they're just falling out. Wow. So therefore, That's you're not peeling, cool. you're not wasting, and then any of the pith will float to the top. That's brilliant. So then you, you just strain you, off the water. I paid eighty thousand dollars to go to culinary school, and I didn't learn that. I was going to say, did somebody did teach not, you that, or was that nope, just your? No, I learned this from a nice young man from Guadalajara. Oh. That showed me how to clean two quarts of pomegranates in less than four minutes. I love it. Okay. So let's now keep going. we go to ambrosia. Mm -hmm. This is probiotic-rich yogurt. If you're buying Danon. Uh, you should be buying something else. Okay. We have a little honey pear vinaigrette, and this is our base. And whenever you're going to drop the base, make sure you have it properly mixed. Mm. All right, now we're going to go raspberries. We're going to go antioxidant rich. These are our pluots, our plums, all that situation. Mm -hmm. Blueberries, strawberries. Blueberries, strawberries. And this wow, is just kind of a you. dump and mix. And this is something that pear, pears, kiwi. kiwi. We went to New Zealand there with the kiwi reference. Nice. Some local dates because why date anyone out of the state? Mm -hmm. And then frozen grapes. Frozen. And the nice thing about frozen grapes is it makes a good reference to let it go for the movie. And it also provides a nice texture inside of here. I'm following you. Good, good, I'm good. picking up what you're throwing down. Good, good, good. And then we go here. Ooh. And then it's just a simple mix. That is your. That is this the. Is it. That's the Peyton Curry Ambrosia curry. Salad, ladies and gentlemen. Curry in a hurry, Ambrosia Salad. Thank you very much. Curry we'll be here hurry. all week. Curry in a hurry. To think minimum. Okay, let me show. <laughs> let me show this real quick too. This is the vegan burger yep. with the uh, apricot chutney. Apricot chutney. Apricot or apricot? Uh, either grape ape, grape apricot, whatever you want to do. Okay. All right. Oh my gosh, that looks amazing. So you go there, and then garnish with a little bit of the leftover mint that we had left. Mm. We'll throw some on our zucchini salad too, just to be fancy. Now, if you're vegan, vegetarian, anything of the sorts, change it up to the way you like it, but make sure you're getting some fresh veggies and fruits in your life. Oh, I gotta try this. You should try it. Okay. All right. Give it a I shot. Must. I just wanted that dressing looked amazing. It's quite good. Mm. So this is something you, you can mix ahead of time. Yep, yeah, recipes online for all this stuff. High yeah. ten. You so rock you can it. you can go that way. And then just to be fancy, we'll garnish. With our Top pomegranate seeds. You, d you took, put all that work into it. Yeah, might as, might well, as well. Right? I mean, we took out some aggression. Chef Peyton Curry. Ladies and you're gentlemen. You're amazing. Thank you very much. Thank you so much. You're Don't welcome, leave love. the building just yet. Don't leave the building. All right.